Hundreds of students and staff arrived at South Dearborn High School on alert this morning. She called to see if everything was okay because she got a call, an automated voice message last night at 1030 asking if anything had happened and if the students didn't want to come that the school would work with the parents about it because of the gun threat that they got. Police could be seen in the parking lots as students arrived. The superintendent says as soon as students told him about the threat overnight, he notified the police and parents. Based upon our conversations, we thought the best course of action was to uh, be transparent about it, to let uh, our parents know we have a partnership with our parents and uh, try to be very open about the knowledge that we have. You wouldn't think it would hit home because we are such a small, tight-knit community. Now in this unfortunate reality where school violence and the possibility of a threat has become a reality, both administrators and students say that it takes a partnership to ensure student safety. South Dearborn schools gave students the option of staying home and increased the police presence on campus. But students say they themselves are the most important part of any safety plan. If you hear anything, get a hold of one of the, the teachers or the police are here, so one of them. We take it very seriously. Whoever if we find out who uh, do any of these acts, we will prosecute them to the fullest extent possible under the law. But so far, no arrests. In Aurora, Richard Childs, WLWT News 5.